Good evening ladies and gentlemen, this is Michael Akahne from Duelist Project and today I'm bringing you end of season commentary on Active Raid. As always, let's have a brief look at what is Active Raid. Active Raid is 12 episode long anime which aired in the season of winter 2016 and it was created by Production IMS and produced by Orange. Uh, I'm not, <laughs> it's not probably one, uh, the mobile operator here in the UK, but yeah. Uh, it's a mecha police anime, and to be honest, it's one of the <sighs> not so good titles this, uh, this season, so I always don't like to put A really bad commentary on something which I've actually finished but it's worse than average let's put it this way it's worse than average uh, and I'll be getting to why um, I mean uh, let's start with the story aspect it was slightly all, uh, over the place with an overreaching theme of this group called Logos just trying to do bad stuff and there were, there were these individual crimes with virtually no in linking uh, to each other and the story progression went there were eight episodes and then we beat the ending and somehow we unfolded the story um, so that's what I kind of particularly disliked about the story because the episodes were not connected and I mean I would not mind if they were not connected <coughs> but if they were done coherently if let's put it this way uh, if I have to compare it uh, to Psychopath which is another police anime and yeah I mean it's doing some comparing a diamond with a pebble but um, Psychopaths had these individual crimes as well, but managed to draw in, do them really well, do it managed to span them across several episodes, and just to do it more in depth. Uh, here it was, oh, we got a criminal. We there is something, uh, some uh, someone else, someone doing something bad with a suit. Let's go arrest him. The end of a one. The end of episode one. Okay, let's do episode two. Let's do the same and do the same pattern with slight changes. And to be honest, uh, even though I finished it, it's was just like okay, let's fill some time, uh, time type of anime. So um, visually, it was attractive. Let's put it this way, because there was a lot of action on uh, on the uh, on the screen, and I mean, yeah, character development none or little, virtually next to none. I just there there were the only character who, who probably went through some development uh, was the main protagonist, uh, the the male female one and uh the sister of the of the for, uh, of the chief and <coughs> the other characters had some minor revelations yeah but nothing too great so <coughs> that was something really really i mean not thought of probably nobody thought what to do with it. I mean, there was some potential to do it. The theme was interesting. The set of characters were was interesting, but it was poorly executed. Poorly written. I mean, I can... I would put more to do... probably stretch it to two seasons, or it's going to get us to seasons, but to... Uh, get this season and stretch it and to make it more let's say interesting to do no no just we're a, a cops we're going to arrest it 
we're going to just arrest the person and just like and then we're done with our work and a week later we got another piece of work yeah uh, that's kind of real life ish probably but it doesn't make an interesting show uh so i mean what was the uh, kind of forgot the show the older one about the police women uh yeah but that was nicely executed as well i mean this one Virtually what it came down to is a poor execution, so there was a potential and it wasn't used. So you got some interesting characters there, but you haven't used them at all. And yeah, so it's kind of wasted effort. Uh, I'll have, uh, as I've said, it's going to get, uh, I've seen it's supposed to get a second season, so... I do not know if I want to pick it up, to be honest at this point. I'll probably will because we'll see. We'll see if there is uh, something more interesting. But if uh, if not, then if there are more interesting, or I'll just decide to put it on the watch list, uh, watch list on the wait list till I mean till to the very bottom of the things. With a note, the first season was bad. So, <clears throat> and give it a, probably a second chance because there have been titles who managed to pull themselves together in the second season, whereas there were titles uh, as Psychopaths where first season was good, second season was sloppy. So, we'll give it a second chance if there is a first season and the second season is rubbish, it's not going to get a third one. So let's put it this way. Favorite characters? Uh no, none. Uh probably uh, if I had to uh, had to pick, uh then it would be uh the chief of the police force because she was cute. And that's probably it. Uh didn't grow attached to any characters at all. And yeah. I mean, there were a couple. I mean, if I had to pick three characters because they were cute, then uh, it would be Asami Kazuri, the main female league, the Rin Yamabuki, the police chief, and the Madoka Mano, uh, the gambling police officer. And that's it. And the, just because they were cute. The guys, just like, oh man, just come on. They were shallow. Uh, then there was this weird mechanic guy. Um, yeah, mm, sure. <coughs> then there were uh, the old man. Yeah, no, not raised anything, and then uh, the other, the other female officer, and yeah, just which was normal, and just this fit. I mean, there was a pure. They had some interesting characters. Some scenes were were interesting, but they didn't didn't finish them properly. So this one is going down as non recommended, and it's going to get score of four. So because yeah because there was some potential visually it was okay and how and yeah that's it <laughs> yeah <laughs> don't want to <clears throat> say anything more because there were I would be able to speak here for hours and which <clears throat> I probably should but given uh, the thing I've the idea of this whole program is to be around 10 minutes uh, or up to 20 minutes maximum. I really don't want to sp be spending and saying this you've done wrong. This probably, if I had to do uh, it for the studio, then I would put more effort into it. But for you, for the people, it's just, it comes to that. It's poorly executed and uh, it's an honor recommend from me this time. So yeah, okay. Thank you. Thank you for watching, people. And if you like this video, please hit like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more content coming your way. We'll I'll be doing more uh, end of a season commentaries, and I'll be doing some one sitting into videos, which will be coming in this and next week as well. Okay. Thank you for listening.